Okay, hi ladies and gents, this is uh, Michael Page Hatton Jr. and we're looking at the pulse motor. We're just building up some speed. Currently we have three coils hooked up with capacitance hooked up in between each coil and in between the reed switch and everything else. So, um, oh yeah, and there's one between the transformer. There's two between the transformer and the coil, first coil. So from the power supply to the capacitance is how it works. And it works, so it's good. Now this is picking up speed. Uh, it doesn't get as fast as if the capacitance was hooked up, wasn't hooked up, I mean. It puts a load on everything, but it's a doable load. I guess. So, yeah, we're just wasting time. We love wasting time. We love doing hard work too, but we end up wasting time doing hard work that perpetuates us wasting time. Like making bi anti phase coils that are going to fry every piece of electronic in my, in my room. <laughs> no, I don't want to do that. Like, if I had a shop or something, that might be cool. I'm going to I'm gonna make something that'll make one of those coils just by turning the crank, though. Well, I'm going to do that. <laughs> uh, exactly how? I'm not quite sure. But it's it's doable. But there's definitely been a crank. Uh, no gears really, but a, something, maybe one gear, like a just something that makes the the two coil holders twist. So it'll, it'll go like this. But at the same time, it'll be drawing on the coil holder that's down at the crank. So it'll it'll pull the two strands together, put one in the center, and then have something that wraps around it like this. That's the best way I think to do it. And it'll be easy to do if I can uh, get the right things. I think I have some of the right things. Uh, let's look. Huh, where'd I put those? Anyway, I've got uh, sewing things to make jewelry with. And I could put that in <clears throat> just uh, use that. Because it's going to pull through, it's just the way that it pulls through is you turn the crank. You spin the coil that it's hooked to. So you got to do that first little twisting yourself uh, and hook it to the, the spool. Turn the crank and it should twist and spool uh, pretty much right there just at the same time. And you got to have space you got to have a uh, clearance because you're going to be spinning two dowels that are probably okay we're cutting the power uh, at least a foot long if not 18 inches and um, you gotta there's got to be some kind of a uh, like a stopping mechanism like a stopper but not it's got to be a stopper that you can put pressure on but at the same time it has a bearing in it that allows it to spin so you can clamp and have it spin which is important because it's gonna when it flips over you don't want it falling off 
and yeah, it's going to flip. It's going to flip a lot. And I'm just going to try and make a proof of concept and then sell it to somebody maybe. Or have somebody, even if I don't get any money for it, to have somebody gank it and make, make it work would be awesome too, honestly. I mean, I wouldn't use an open source network if I didn't think that if I made something and put it on there, somebody might gank it. Gank is to steal. Look at that. That is beautiful. Zero, 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 zero. No power going through. Except for the powers generated by the three coils. And the power that was uh, started. You know, you juice. When you turn on the power, the capacitance immediately juices up. Because the power supply and the capacitance are on the same circuit. This shit, shit, shit. <laughs> this sh Nikki had. It all happens at the same time with electricity. It's not like it takes a bunch of time to complete a circuit. It's pretty instantaneous. Oh. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go. Uh, I think we started at like four. 420 so we are currently at three minutes in 10 seconds I just stepped on my vacuum it's not not right it's not good you see what I'm thinking about doing is maybe replacing the big coil with uh, 65 feet or 200 feet of one millimeter wire I just I don't think I need 200 feet I mean I can buy 200 feet and make a bunch of coils with it So it looks like it's going to go for four minutes. I mean, I don't think this stuff really counts. It's spinning. Nope. It's just under four minutes. Okay. That's, you know, not as good as my other discs, but for a pulse motor rotor, I think that's pretty all right with no power. And the thing there is that... It's not like it's running on the capacitors, but the capacitor is helping it run, which makes it run longer. Anyway, thank you. Please subscribe. Have a good night. Talk to you later. Peace out.